Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel, and uh, we have an update for Microsoft Edge. Now, of course, we uh, knew that that was coming this week. Uh, security updates are here, and uh, the uh, security update arrived uh, late yesterday, uh, December 14th. And so if you go into your upper right corner, three horizontal dots, go into help and feedback about Microsoft Edge, you will have the update to 120.0.2210.77. Now this is to fix the 10.9.9 security flaws discovered uh, that are most of them high severity in Chromium. So of course, Google Chrome was the first one to get the fix. And now we have Edge. Some users told me that Brave already got a, the update also. So if you're using that browser, and I would guess that most other Chromium browsers are getting it already. So it's important to uh, update. Remember that that's your number one security. Once again, too many people think, oh, number one security, I'm going to put an antivirus. Nope, number one security is all the updates. Security updates are the number one priority. Then after the security updates, what you do is the second priority. This is the real security. Unfortunately, too many people think otherwise, and it's not the case. And so um, the web browser, of course, being one of your first lines of defense, because that's where you go to browse the web. And if you go onto web pages that have all sorts of weird malformed codes that are meant to try to infiltrate systems, well, it doesn't work because your computer has the updates. This is what blocks 90% plus percent of all the malware because the malware needs to get in somehow and most of the time it gets in through either a flaw or an action from yourself and the flaws well they're fixed if you have the updates and yourself well you just got to be careful not to click on everything you see or you know just use your uh, common sense basically works very very well in uh, staying safe so update Edge, and even if you don't use Edge, I recommend that you do update anyways, because you know that sometimes it happens that links open in Edge, even if you don't want to. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.